Hello everyone, this is Paul from Hi-Fi Man. Our Android screen have 4G LTE functions, but some of our friends didn't know how to use it. Today, I will have a demo. Okay, now let's go. Here is the 4G SIM card uh, in China here. You can find the SIM card in your side. Different country, the SIM card model is different. I have put a link in the website to show different countries, different brand and model for the 4G SIM card. You can go to our website and in here, FIQ. Four G Wi Fi. This one, Q three. Which brand support four G LTE? In this page, it lists different countries, uh, different models, different brand. You need to prepare a pin here like this, and this is the 4G SIM card slot. In fact, different model, the location of 4G SIM card slot might be different. For example, this model, uh, this old model, it designed the SIM card slot on the back. It have a cover here. Here you can see there's a label mark. This is the SIM card. And this label also show you the directions. You should insert the SIM card like these directions. If your model, the SIM card like this, you need to, uh, you need a cover, and put the SIM card inside here. These directions, and insert the SIM card uh, like this one here. Insert. It. Some models, the SIM card on the side. Here. And this one, the SIM card is here. Take out the SIM card holder. You can see here. Uh, this direction. This direction. The SIM card to the SIM card slot. In fact, on the back, you can see. It also have a plastic mark here to show you the direction of the SIM card. Uh, this direction. That's fine, right? You should notice uh, you need to install the 4G uh, antenna here. Uh, please notice, don't stick this antenna to the back of the display. That is not allowed. And don't install this to the metal parts. It's not allowed to stick to the metal parts. And please notice, keep a distance to the GPS antenna. Now we just power on. And here, you should notice, when your Android screen is power on, you insert the SIM card. That way, you need to restart the Android screen. Now, because I don't power on the Android screen, so I insert the SIM card, so we can power on, okay? Here you can see, uh, it shows the 4G information here. It can read the 4G SIM card automatically. Android. You can click the network and internet. Please notice, don't, uh, don't turn on the air mode or uh, airplay mode. If you turn on, it will not work. You can see, it not show. Uh, you can see here, this is the China uh, LTE 4G internet. So now we can uh, visit uh, internet. Uh, for example, I want to show you uh, the internet. You can see here, uh, everything is fine, right? 
Now we can take a look at the setting for the SIM card here. You can see this on. Here is on. Here. 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 Automatic Slack network is on. Here. This is the China Unicom. It should connect. Some friends are uh, when he used these functions, it not work. So you can click here, access point names. In this part, I'm talking about the troubles for the 4G LTE. The first one, the Android screen cannot detect the SIM card you insert. How to handle this? And the second is, it have the 4G signal in the Android screen, but it cannot visit the internet how to handle this for the first trouble you can check these steps one by one all these steps have mentioned in this video and i would like to share a video for you this is the video i like to share you here and in this video it installed two brands for the sim card the first one is not fit and he tried the second one, then will be fine. So, the model and the brand of SIM card is very important. You can take a look. The website uh, I offer you. Another trouble is it has 4G signal, but it cannot visit the internet. For this trouble, we can change the APN. APN is access point. Access. Name. Names. For the IPN setting, uh, I like to share you a video. Here, yeah. this video. It show how to make the setting for the IPN. Here. Yeah. Okay. I will put this link in the video description below. You can also put the SIM card to the cell phone, and go to the IPN in the cell phone. Write down the records for the IPN. After that, you can insert this SIM card to the Android screen. And you made the setting with the same setting as the cell phone's IPN. That way, it will be okay.